Hello everybody, how's it going? My name is Enkais. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Enkais Plays Dead Cells, the Elemental Update version. Um, I, I didn't think I would come back to the game because I was so frustrated with like some of the design aspects. But, you know, I... Oh, am I at the beginning of it on? I think I am. Pretty sure I am. Yeah. But, you know, I'm not just not going to be satisfied until I beat that stupid watcher, man. And... Um, you know, I've gotten some tips, some some pointers about like a setup that would work against them and whatnot. And uh, if apparently the the whip is great to have, which makes sense because uh, let's go let's go strength because the whip is quick and it's homing, so it just connects to. Uh, the enemies and the the boss and tentacles and stuff like that. So I'm 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 hoping to end up with relevant skills that can help me in the boss fight, and then you know against like the Watcher's body itself, like with the with the uh, electric whip, electric whip, electrical whip. I'm not sure, and then have reliable skills that I can use against the tentacles because the tentacles are. Probably not going to take that much damage from the uh, electrical whip. Like, you won't even... Oh, nice. Actually, cool. Like, it, it's sort of not even going to matter much against the tentacles. Like, the am damage output is not going to be uh, good enough unless I end up with, like, I don't know, like, 8, 9 strength, maybe then. But still, I feel like the tentacles are still really tanky. And one of the best ways you can go against them is by having a lot of uh, just elemental stuff against them. And status ailments, like bleeding, or setting them on fire, or poison, stuff like that. Oh, we don't have a teleporter activated down here. Just gonna take the long way and walk. So I'm hopeful. I'm pretty salty. Uh, of course, the game is very new and it's in very, very early access, but, you know, you, you can't have, like, too many expectations. And they're still working on things and balancing it, and I don't even have, like, all the blue blueprints or anywhere near having the full collection. Um, and something that I recently found out is that apparently every enemy has a unique blueprint that they drop at like a very low percentage like uh, for example uh, as well as like boss fights like if you do boss fights flawlessly like you know attack the the wat watcher without taking any damage and kill him then you, you get something or something like that <laughs> well we have the electric whip but it's a terrible electric whip what is it? It's just, yeah, it is it is so basic, bare bones, nothing on it, it's definitely gonna change. Um, but the Watcher also has like another drop, uh, it, it drops a blueprint for a cursed sword, that if you, if you have it, if you take damage at all, you die, kind of like the, the cursed treasure chests and the condition they put you in. Um, Meh. But anyway, we're gonna we're gonna try to be quick, and we're gonna try to be thorough. I don't mind going to the promenade of the condemned. Uh, I, I I went online and I looked at the little map, like a little diagram of. By the way, we can press hide and just get rid of anything that's no not available to be uh, upgraded instead of having to go down a list. That is all, you know, mixed up. Uh, I went online and I looked at a little map of the place. Like a little diagram that showed all the connections between the levels. And basically the only difference is just the first two levels that you start. And uh, how they connect. And then after that you're basically funneled into going to the, to the graveyards and stuff like that. And ultimately reaching the same boss fights okay okay I need I need more strength we need to get stronger 
so I don't care how I get there. So if I if I feel a little underpowered like right now with super basic weapons, I'm just gonna take whatever route. Eventually we're gonna have to go through the same levels. All right. It's just like, do you want to go through the ossuary and uh, then do pretty much like four levels that are shared between all the branches afterwards, or do you want to go to like what are the other places? The rampart? Wait, I think this goes to the rampart. Like, do you want to go to the sewers, or do you want to go to like the prison depths and whatnot? I don't, I don't remember the names. I don't care. Let's just, they just all different ways to one end all means to the same end there we go excuse me camera pan I still can't see where the spikes end all right I see what is this Also, another reason I didn't pull the plug completely on the series is because you guys still enjoy it, and it still gets good viewership on my channel, and if it's, if it's something that you guys still enjoy watching, then it's somewhat within my duty, as long as I enjoy playing it to a certain degree, to, you know, still deliver the content to you guys. You're more important than uh, my little nags and complaints about this and that in the game. So, let's just use a teleporter. Okay. And um, we're also going to be more diligent with the secrets, like this guy over here. I'm not too bad with them, but I tend to kind of miss them and forget about them and just they escape my mind. The deeper I go, the moonstone amulet, like amulet, like that 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 makes no difference to me. Like the name does not tell me anything. I'm just gonna have to skip it. What what happened to the music? Hello? Music. Oh, there it is. It's so quiet. It's kind of eerie. Kind of weird. It makes me self-conscious. You know, I use headphones, so I actually hear my own voice when I do recordings for all my games. And when the music is really low, and then I hear myself too much, I, I get a little uncomfortable. I'm like, can you please just... Wait, is the music just too low? No, I think it's coming back. <laughs> this is a little weird. Alright, let's go. Man, this is so much better. There we go. Distract me from my own voice. And the reason I uh, have my headphones to hear my own voice is kind of like the same reason singers have headphones. Enemies burn when they die. 20% damage. Sure. I'm mostly relying on my strength anyway, so I don't care what my skills are going to be at this point of time. But, uh, yeah, it's like the same reason why singers have their headphones and hear their own voice. It's a matter of... Oh, no you don't. It's a matter of, uh... Balancing audio levels and making sure that you're not spiking or you're not getting too loud or you're not too quiet. And making sure that everything sounds nice, relatively. Okay, 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 listen, listen, listen. No. Oh, okay. You know, I'm pretty lucky that when I jumped on the spikes again that second time, I didn't take any damage. I wonder if that's a thing or if I just got lucky. I'll, I'll take it. Either way, I'm fine. Game glitch or not, it's called a feature, huh? Checking, checking for secrets, because we know that the secrets could either contain money, or they could be food, or in very, very, very rare instances, they could be power-ups. Another approach that I want to have in this run to everything 
like items or whatnot is I'm gonna I'm gonna take anything that's gonna give me a status bonus because I feel like the game has a set number of scrolls that it spawns per levels and if there are the pieces of equipment that contain a skill up within them then I think they kind of take the place of a scroll so if you don't take that item with the power up associated with it then you're basically missing out on a potential point that you're not gonna oh I, I, I remember it too late that you're not gonna gain by through any other means like you're not gonna find a scroll to to make up for it so I'm gonna I'm gonna try to make do with whatever the game gives us as long as it has bonus stats associated with it like HP up or Ooh. Like skill up or strength up even if we end up with something entirely too funky even if it's gonna be like okay we gotta draw the line somewhere right like I'm not gonna go and do something like two shields but even if it's gonna be like shoes and shield or two bows I'll give it a shot if the bow if both of the bows are gonna have like say a skill up on them and a health up, I'll, I'll do it we'll suffer it's gonna be funky but it's gonna be kind of entertaining and zany and maybe it will actually be super powerful and we'll end up with something that breaks the normal cap that we deal with of around like seven or eight kind of across the board I also don't want to have a balanced build this time around I'd rather kind of experiment so I want to have <clears throat> ultimately if I can just have like a strength and skills build and then do my best when it comes to avoiding damage what this is okay this is this is dumb what that that was what but anyway yeah just just have that approach and when it comes to like the when it comes to time to fight the boss we don't have enough power, this place is kicking my arse, or I'm just not on top of my game. But, <laughs> to finish that freaking sentence that I've started so many times, is I'd rather just have lower than normal HP and rely on better dodging skills that I have shown zero proficiency at during this one right now, and just dodge most of the boss's attacks but have powerful weapons, or at least a lot of strength, and a lot of points put into skills that makes sense it better make sense I'm actually down to go to the prison depths I rarely go there I rarely go there let's go to the prison depths hey man It's extremely quiet music. Sorry about your door. Yeah, just, just give me more money. But I know I'm not even using my electric whip. Because I don't think it just has like a viable damage output right now. It's not even higher level. I'm, I'm still basic weapons going into the prison depth. So wish me luck, man. We're going to get our asses handed to us. Or I should say my ass handed to me you guys are innocent <laughs> you're just innocent bystanders the dear viewers uh this is a place with the annoying hedgehog dudes right so we're gonna have fun dealing with them i've only seen the pain and suffering they cause for other people that i've watched playing this game occasionally like wanderbot or a few northern lion or bear taffy episodes i get out of here Yeah, damage output. Yeah, it's, it's not good. Oh, sweet. Look at that. It's like the game knows about my plan. And it provided me the second electric whip of the run at level 5. 45%. <laughs> We're getting 40% extra damage right there. 100% damage on a burning target, which works well with the turret. So now I think my main weapon is going to be the whip after we set up the 
the flame flame turret down. It just feels like yes, yeah, the game is super quiet. Okay, we'll go back in here. We'll do the master volume. Now these sounds are too loud. It's, yeah, it's a little uh, unbalanced. Whoa, yeah, that last one sounds really loud. Okay, this is a little better. Now we hear things. Okay. Where are my ground runes? I want to do those challenges. I did two challenges in the last video. Oh, go to hell. Oh, he just endlessly summons them. All right, okay, 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 okay. okay. Um, Ed. <laughs> you gotta cut me some slack there, though. That was the first time that I was actually facing that enemy. Oh, there we go, extra quip. The game knows. Just the, it hears me. I dodged. You saw my guy turn around. My B button didn't work. That is... That is something. Oh. Great. Oh. This is definitely going to be a better run. This is a way better startup. Assassin Dagger. Definitely what I like. But yeah, that was the first time that I was dealing with that guy. Kind of didn't know what to expect. Okay. 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 Okay, this is this is a little getting a little silly now. I feel like it doesn't even <laughs> it doesn't doesn't even change. What gifts? What's going on? Okay, that's an acceptable level of audio for the music. Sorry about playing around with that so much. You know, I think it's out of the question. Uh, we need to have a higher level of uh, HP. So we need to make sure that our HP is set first. Before I decide to go down into uh, a more dangerous area like the prison depths. I'll take you. As long as you're worth it. Baby, you're worth it. What sort of thing did I even get? Grenade 2 is all I get? Yeah, I guess it's like a cursed chest on the first floor, so... Lower expectations... Oh, okay. Uh, dude, I'm in the shop. I'm shopping? Wait, something comes comes out of it. The viscera of dead victims explode. Oh, okay. Fine. You're 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 a weird being. You're you're weird. If nobody's told you yet. You're definitely weird. That guy's just gonna stand there and look at me. Nice dodge, dudes. Oiled sword. It's too low level. I'm working with some crits over here. I don't wanna lose that. Oh, oh, come on. Come on. one more enemy to go to lift the curse and that enemy is you you poor soul the curse has been lifted what oh there we go we are doing that i love this assassin dagger 
just love the, the way it sounds. And the visual effects for all the crits that I do. We're gonna continue exploring the floor here. I'd rather be more prepared. I don't know about bear traps. I knew you drop like two now, or it's it's more than one at least, but I eh. And I'd rather just hold on to my whip, even if it's going to be like a level 1 whip. Even if I... Even if it's going to be just this level 1 whip. Until I get to the Watcher fight. Music? Me... Me... Music? Me... Where are you? <laughs> what? What happened? <laughs> Come back to me? Me? Hello? You know? I, I gotta admit, this game is not as glorious and epic when you play it without the music. It does build up the excitement, gotta admit. <laughs> this is so weird. See, I don't I don't wanna talk much now. <laughs> what the hell game? Did I hurt your feelings or something? Well, what happened to trigger this? What is going on? You guys broke your game. See if doing this challenge is gonna restore the uh, audio. No, it, doesn't. it does not. It, yep, totally doesn't. This is so weird. Oh, nice miss. But, yeah. Um, music? Hello? Music, come back! You can blame it all on me. I was loud. Oh. Come on. Okay, there you go. That was that was dicey, I admit it. Um yeah, please give me that. Twenty percent damage, fires a volley of arrows. Um damage output increase. Can can I get Can I get my music back? Sorry about all your doors. I mean, we know that obviously this guy's gonna be the final boss, right? He's collecting all these cells to become so overpowered, he's probably deceiving us by helping us along the way. And then he's just gonna be like, ha, 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 You fool! You gave me the strength! To bring total annihilation to the entire world. And then he like... He absorbs all the cells. Thousands of them. And he grows into a demon. I mean, he's kind of a demon already, but... You know. Okay, these guys are not dying quickly. No. No. Don't... Don't groan at me. I'm not your mom. Okay, that's powerful still. Maybe I should just try to kill all the enemies like that instead. <laughs> okay. 
Thank you for the music. Please don't let it happen again. Come up me at a correct angle, please. Can you not not do that? What are you doing? Do you do you have anybody you were supporting? I feel a little bad for you. Lonely dumb, the lonely dummy. Oh, see, this guy has business. Wow, that guy saw me up there, aimed for me up there, and then decided to completely change his mind and mid throw change his trajectory down. I guess I'm cool with that. Uh, yeah. Yeah, and the music is extremely quiet here. The, this update has done something to the game. It's broken the audio levels for sure. How long? Four minutes. Get out of here. That's the surprise of being thorough. Okay. My choice. We'll go HP. Just checking everywhere for runes. And I'm just gonna hope that the next scroll is going to be strength or one that will actually allow me to choose, because I will I need strength. And I think it's it it's not a good idea the design decision to have these uh, restricted scrolls that you don't have, you can't choose. Like back in the day, all the scrolls you had a choice, and that actually led to a lot of uh, cool little uh, powerful builds you could you could actually create. But now it, everything is more limited because the game just gives you predetermined. Uh, Scrolls like there you go. That's a strength upgrade. How about no? How about you leave all of them up to me? I want to have a build where I have 15 in, in strength and two in he health like I think it would be a better game design if you still allowed that creating the game ch like making the game challenging enough to It's it's still challenging. I mean even if you had like 15 strength you could get hit by an axe or something and it could end you you know, it's not like it's completely restricting anything. I think that. It would really increase the variety. A lot of people some creativity and freedom with that. Where is this dummy? See, even if I dealt like 15 damage in this situation right now. It wouldn't have been enough to save me, so... Why not change the design? Wait, this is double damage. Wait, it's double damage, I don't want that. Why not adjust the challenge and change the design so that people can do that and you would still kick their butt? Because I'm assuming the reason they don't want that is because People could exploit it by having, like, way too much. And I think the only deterrent... Oh, just lay off, dude. I think the only th deterrent is uh, abusing skills, because you could just... Get off! Lay off, dude! Dude, what a jerk! Anyway, again, I think the thing that's stopping them from doing that is assuming that people will abuse the skills and just put everything into skills and stand back and spam skills. I totally get it. But whose fault is that? Is this door? Oh, there's a, there's a ledge there this time. Okay. No problem. Yeah, the last one was awful. Could understand how you're supposed to approach it.
There you go. Now we're dealing some good damage. But at the same time, my skills are... Oh, my good. My skills are suffering a lot. You need a new door. It's a downgrade. The shop is selling underpowered things. Are you cereal? Where's my uh, amulet? 10% damage reduction. What does this make you invisible? Your next strike will, while still being invisible, inflicts 150% damage. Nah, it's not that. I'm not that crazy about it, I guess. Let's go up. Take me away. Thanks. It's like I don't even know how to jump anymore. When you want to get off the ledge sometimes, you just can't help but keep climbing back up, you know, because it's so sticky. And then in that instance, yeah, I'm just going to ignore the ledge for you. Sure, for sure, for sure. Yep, there we go. There, there we go. Right, right. <laughs> yeah. Plus one skill. You remember what I told you? Say goodbye to that. We're gonna have the whip. We're the boss, and we're gonna have the blades because they give stats. Take the teleporter. What are you doing? Who walks nowadays? Just take the teleporter. Forget about exercising. This is gonna be funky. My whip is not strong enough. We're gonna set up some bleeds on them. Okay. Could work. It's great for those enemies, of course, for these stupid flyers. Haha. <laughs> Just out of reach for you, buddy. Okay, now I really need to get more strength. Or HP. What is that? Not good enough? Yeah, not good enough. The whip is also pretty good at finding secrets for you, so we're gonna be spamming it everywhere we get. Okay. Basically done here. We're gonna go up. I'm not gonna make the same mistake. I'm this time. It's, I'm gonna. I feel like. I'm even weaker than the last attempt, so I'm definitely not gonna try to go to the harder levels with freaking throwing knives and a level what? Level one whip? No thank you. I think the basic zombies will take a millennia to kill. Ramparts it is. A weak character for a weak level. Let's go. To each their own. Yeah, this is like the easier place. So if it takes that many uh, whippings to kill these guys. It, yep. This is definitely below optimum. We're going to be using some skills, of course, that I've been totally ignoring because they're level 2. They're not... They're doing a little bit of... Uh, well, no, not really. Damage is terrible. Yeah. <laughs> Let's run is something special.
you know, the game kind of forces you to have a balanced run because you constantly feel like you're either lacking HP or your weapons and skills are not powerful enough to deal with enemies. It doesn't really allow much room for creative sort of setups and loadouts when you think about it. Sure, it wouldn't have been my pick. I probably would have gone with strength. Maybe even HP. No, probably strength. I feel like I've been pretty diligent with the secrets, but I'm just not finding any, really. Wow, dude. Wow, dude. Again, I probably would have taken strength. You're really limiting me here. It's not like I'm getting five scrolls per level. Giving me things that I really don't want. Now, throwing knives giving me one skills. You can go suck it. The music here is all messed up too. Oh, oops. It takes so long to kill enemies. You're an elite, that's why your slide is so long. You know what? I don't want to deal with you. What is what? Why? You're gonna give me like a grenade level one? No, thank you. So we're gonna take strength. The door was sealed 25 hours ago. Ow. Just ignore, ignore him. You know what you do with trolls? Just ignore him. He's a freaking troll. There you go. Chuck that. We got places to be. It takes way too much to, to just deal with one enemy, like I have to bleed him and nade him and whip him and then burp. I press the trigger there. Um, Man, I need to put a, uh, an input device on my screen, like you know those uh, the apps that show what buttons you're pressing on your controller and can display that on your screen, because um, there are so many inputs that get ignored and skills are supposed to be like interrupts and I pull the trigger, never threw the grenade. There's no runes. What happened to all the runes? My god! How did you live? Oh Jesus, that, that, that was, that was gross. That sound was horrifying. Um, replace a fire grenade. One strength, alright. You know, we're sticking to my method here. Take anything that gives you skill ups. And by skill ups, I mean just general power ups. Terminology in this game is kind of confusing.
it, it now it's becoming somewhat viable to use the electric whip. Still not that great, but not awful either. I need to replace these. I need to swap those. Because my bleed is somewhat secondary. I just bleed them once and I need my main attack to be um, the whip now. We're not done, right? <sighs> the music is done. The game audio in this game is done for. Goodbye. Oh, Jesus. Your range, dude. Your range. Nope. You don't have the skill associated. Sorry, buddy. Don't care about your damage output. I'm pretty sure his stat up is more um, viable. Good? Gouda, Gouda. You're here. Now you're in hell. Dude, way too much planning for just one simple confrontation here. Get get away. I gotta freeze them, then I gotta bleed them, then I gotta whip them. Then you add uh, 12 ounces of water and place the mixture in the fridge for 12 hours overnight. Then you come back, add the vanilla and stir it in some warm water. Then add 3 grams of ginger. Way too much work. Like confusing buttons left and right constantly here. Woo! You wanna die? <laughs> Let me give you a bush laugh. <laughs> no, it's not good. It's not good. it's not it's gotta, you know, I gotta it's gotta come naturally. <laughs> no, it's not working. Oh my god. Not good enough. Well, this one says 175% on a frozen target, but at what cost? Not much. I will take you. This one doesn't give me a stat up, so we'll throw the freeze? We'll do the ice grenade first and then turret? I mean, he's frozen only for like the first instant. Is it even worth it? I don't know. Does it really work out? I don't know. Don't. Don't. Where are we going? Where are we, and where are we headed to? Okay. Yeah, I'm not too sure about this. Hmm. Dude, it's so quiet. It's so quiet. Ooh. 
we're gonna face the incomplete one now with a very strange setup should I take the fire grenade level 3? No, we're fine with this. Okay, let's face the first boss. I think more than half uh, an hour into the episode by now. Uh, well, well, well. Can you permanently just take these away? Do I have to do that every single time? Can you remember my preferences game? Much appreciate. Good luck. It's gonna be funky. <laughs> the illiterate one. Oh, we're out of ammo, right, right. That's why you don't take knives to a fight. The music is certainly back here. Oh, hello. <laughs> you suck. Oh, ow. Okay. <laughs> oh, right. I was so happy that I was behind him. I was just waiting for him, like, looking at him. Oh, you are such a fool. Joke was on me though. Ow! Right, just jump over that. What are you doing? We'll be fine, but. Um, oh my gosh! It's not, dude. Let's not make stupid mistakes. We know how to fight this boss. Let's not hub hubris get in the way. Like when I was standing behind him just laughing at him in my head. Ow. Ow. Right, don't, don't do that. Don't, why? I am fighting him with funky stuff, though. Granted. Oh, you can still jump. Oh, I, I, I. That was that was me sizing it. I was like, are you gonna be stuck within the the magnetic sphere? You're dead. I'm more dead than me. Excuse me. Okay, just leave! God. 36 years ago. <laughs> what a weird feature. Hey, do you want the option to get rid of the annoying, unavailable upgrades? Ha <laughs> ha well guess what? We're gonna know you further by not making it permanent, making you do it every time. Na na woo woo. good enough dude not good enough because of my equipment I'm at six strength if I take things off I lose so much ow I love getting slingshotted by that did you see that the enemy kill sent me up in the sky
Definitely not. Shut your mouth, chest. I could be cheesy and I could just stand up here and do that, but it's just going to be too slow for you guys. I don't want to make it painful to watch. Oh, there's multiple. Multiple. Watch out. Not, not good enough. Simply not good enough. I'll pay the price. Sorry, you need the whip. Sorry, you need my stat ups. Sorry, change your game design, make it better. I'm kind of trying to make a point here too, as you can obviously see. I... <laughs> Don't touch my portal. What do you even want? Strength up would be great. Abilities? I think abilities are, are, are really far behind right now. Skills, I mean. Don't, 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 don't make this mistake. What are you doing? You know that he can't do that. Not with two. You gotta cheese him. You gotta cheese him. You don't. You won't have a chance. Kill all the enemies. All right. It's gonna take forever, but we'll kill all the enemies if we must. Oh, I made a huge mistake. Yeah, that's just, that's just, we don't have it. We don't have it. We do not possess what it takes. It's gonna be interesting, actually. You know, the boss fight, the watcher fight might actually go way smoother than these uh, regular levels right now. So. Thanks, buddy. Ow. Ow. Please. Let's cheese it up. Parmesan and all. Oh, it's like th 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 them showing up in pairs is now a, a regular thing. Of course you're gonna oversaturate me with skills. Now that I chose skills on my last one, that was my choice. Should've known. Should've known. 
you know, it's my own fault. Should have kept the one that's going to be my choice as the last one to take and should have gone through the entire level, found everything else, and then went back for that and made, like, a, a, an educated decision based on how the run's going. But... I'm willing to do so much for a game, like, bad game design, you know? The game's, like... In every every turn, it contradicts itself. Like it encourages speed to make it to like time doors and whatnot. But if you're not, if you go fast enough, you will miss out on the the skills that are scattered throughout the level. So you you're forced to you're forced to go explore. And then every every run takes like a millennia anyway. And then you want me to hold the scroll until I see what else is what else is there and then go back for it? No man. So I don't know what the game's ultimately trying to do. Like are we trying to are you encouraging people to go fast? Or go slow? Are you forcing backtracks? Can we talk about this? There are enough doors for me to, to break to stun you, you know? If you didn't get stunned by the left one, I'll kick your ass with the right one. Don't you doubt it for it. Hot damn second, alright? Get away from me. Oh, this is taking forever. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm like spamming knives and whipping him. But nope! Your efforts are futile. Good job. <laughs> My <laughs> only actual source of damage right now is this grenade. Because grenades actually do good damage. And that's why I took the grenades over the like, magnetic thing. Because that wasn't doing anything. You know, it was... Yeah, sure, it was... Oh, my God. Alright, just exclude yourself from that scene. There's no reason why we should do that. There's no reason why we should. Oh. Get your HP back. Get your HP back. We don't have heals. Oh, this is so frustrating. This is so frustrating. Oh, hey. Hey. Hi, how's it going? Hey, how you doing? Don't murder me. I don't. Don't. Allow me to murder myself. We have no reason to be here. I'm just looking for scrolls and we're going to be gone. Don't follow me. Don't don't follow me, dude. Don't. Don't. Don't do that. No. Nope. Nope. Not your friend. We'll never hang out with you. Oh, yeah. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like, thank you for your time and attention. I'll see you guys in next time that we struggle with terrible game design. Oh, I'm sorry, I mean, uh, Dead Cells. Bye-bye.